Have you read the game instructions? Is your game board set up? Good. Then you know that there are three sets of action cards, building cards, Demona wild cards, and Elisa badge cards. When you land on an action card space, take that card and do what it says. Also, when you land on a subway tunnel, follow the tunnel all the way to the other side. Sometimes you'll shoot forward, sometimes you'll shoot back. A player wins the game by landing on Xanatos' tower with an exact spin. But watch out for the square before it. It'll send you back 10 spaces. And most important, when lightning strikes, stop playing and watch the screen for instructions. My name is Xanatos, and in 20 minutes I'll destroy the gargoyles unless you, the players, can stop me. But you'll have to be quick, because if you don't get to the end of the game in 20 minutes, I will lead my steel clan into action, and then Goliath and the gargoyles will have no choice but to surrender. <laughs> Nothing can stop me now. I'm afraid I can't allow you to stop Xanatos. The success of his plan directly affects mine. So the player who just spun must go back six spaces. All right, players, I can't do this alone. If Xanatos is to be stopped, you're going to have to help me. The player who just spun can now pick up a badge card. Do what it says, and hurry. 
You think that detective can help you? She is nothing compared to the power of the Grimorum. I freeze the player who just spun on the space you are on now. You cannot move until I come back and release you. Enough! I release the frozen player. You may continue now, but be warned. I can freeze any of you whenever I want. <laughs>
Come on, guys. I'm counting on you. I know it's a big city, but you've got to hurry. You're my only hope. The player who just spun must go to the closest subway entrance in front or behind you and ride the train. I just hope you get on one going the right direction. Everything is nearly ready. Soon I will unleash the clan and take control of the gargoyles once and for all. But the players are getting closer. I must do something to slow them down. Time is running out for them. Perhaps Demona can suggest how to slow them down. Let's have the player who just spun go back eight spaces. <laughs> Just because you found me doesn't mean Xanatos is going to get away with this. I'm going to help the player who just spun to move ahead five spaces. Mr. Xanatos' plans are too far along now for any help of yours to put a stop to them. Let the player move ahead. It won't do you or the gargoyles any good now.
that detective wants to spoil everything, but I'm going to change all that. The player who just spun must now pick up a Demona card and do what it says. As you can see, your efforts are proving to be quite futile. There's still some time left, enough for the next player to pick up a badge card and follow the instructions on it, whether you like it or not. countdown has begun. The destruction of the gargoyles is at hand. Your time to stop me is swiftly coming to a close.
I'm afraid you and your players are too late. My armor and my robots are now complete. There's nothing you can do to stop me from teaching the gargoyles who their true master is. Maybe this time Xanatos, but there'll be another. Attack. Xanatos has won this time, but you have a chance to try and stop him again. Through the power of the Grimorum and modern sorcery, you can go back in time. When the words Orde Rewindum Tapis from the Grimorum appear on the screen, speak them out loud. Stop the tape, rewind to the beginning of the game, and start again. Only you can prevent Xanatos from defeating the Gargoyles again.